Observer Moore. I'm the agent for Country Tracks here in Tennessee. Today we're in Mont Eagle and we're looking at a property called Stagecoach Pass. Uh, this is a series of three tracks, three large tracks. Uh, track A, uh, the first track, a little over 56 acres, and it sort of features everything that you'd want in a piece of property. It has creeks, it has ponds, it has views, it has woods, and it even has a waterfall. Uh, not much more you can ask for. Folks, uh, let's talk about track B now here at Stagecoach Pass. This is a little over 40 acres. It has woods, very gently rolling property. It has a beautiful creek on there and the views are spectacular. Um, numerous, numerous build sites on this property. You're gonna love it. Stagecoach Pass is a little over 100 acres, nearly 110 acres, covered up with wildlife. Lots and lots of woods, incredible views. It has a pond, uh, trickling waterfalls, many, many places to build on this. And of course, all these tracks uh, have utilities available, electric, water, phone, cable, internet, fiber optics. Uh, it's gonna give you everything that you need to build that home and, you know, for the future. Highlights are Stock Lake, this little lake back behind me, Lake Louisa. Uh, up the road here is an area for you to store your kayak or canoe. And just across the street from that is a picnic area. It's got a beautiful pavilion with a great lookout area if, if you want to have a picnic, family picnic, or even a family reunion.
we're at the gate. Uh, in front of us is the road that'll take you right into Mon Eagle. Uh, you would access tracks A and B through the gated community of Cooley's Rift, which gives you a little more security if, if, if you want that feeling. Track C has its own entrance right off of Main Street here. Um, what we're looking at here is the trail system that runs along Main Street. That there's miles and miles of hiking, biking, walking trails, and most of that's maintained by the county or Sewanee University of the South. If you haven't seen Sewanee University of the South, please take a minute to do that. It's an Ivy League college that survived the Civil War. Buildings are just spectacular. It looks like something out of a Harry Potter. You'd love it. It's just great to drive through and have a look at it. Guys, thanks for taking the time to look at these videos today. Please go to our website, countrytracks.com, fill out the information, and what we'll do is we'll get back with you with additional maps, videos, whatever you'd like, and also keep, you know, make sure you monitor that because we're always putting new uh, properties on that website. We're keeping it up next Thanks again.